Hi everyone, this is a video about this webcam Technet HD 720p webcam with USB 2 and uh, the reason that I've purchased this is because I was looking for a rear view video camera for my bicycle in order to avoid using the normal uh, mirrors for my bicycle because most of the time when you are using these uh, mirrors they are shaky and then either your wrist or your elbow or your body is on the way uh, obstructing your view rear view uh, of your bicycle somehow I thought okay I'm going to buy a rear view video camera for my bicycle but unfortunately most of them they have they consume 12 volts and 12 volts is a little bit heavy for the bicycle if you want to make a power supply for it and then I come up with an idea that with the aid of a webcam and OTG cables and your old mobile phones around the house most of us we have an old mobile phone that is unusable but still you can use them for other purposes and I come up with this uh, webcam this webcam is of good quality and it comes in this box and then I get everything out of this box and then we talk more in the box we are getting the webcam and then some promotional card and then a CD driver CD for your PC and then manual for your uh, usage with the PC or your laptop and I just hold it shortly for you to just have a read if you want then on the other side is somehow installation instruction that is not really necessary because these are nowadays they are plug and play so we put these aside and we talk about the uh, webcam itself this webcam as I mentioned is 720 pixel and it has 10 times digital zoom and you can focus the view with this ring to the top of the lens and then it has a microphone and a button to take a picture if you like and then at the here you can turn it 360 degrees and then from here you can turn it I think 180 degrees as beyond this uh, half circle is useless really it would be much better if you could turn it all the way around but it's okay and then it has this uh, clip that you can clip it over the screen of your uh, laptop or your PC at home and then it has a six LED normal lights and they are more or less useless mm, to be honest with you and it has a volume to control the brightness of that but uh, is the dimming action is non-existent because at the end it just turns itself on and off otherwise all the way down and all the way up is not going to dim it at all it just comes on suddenly at the really the end of this volume and uh, really useless anyhow the price of this is under 10 pounds but there are copies of this on eBay from China 
that is under five pounds and the way to uh, recognize those is the cable this cable has uh, uh, this sort of anti <coughs> sort of uh, how do you call this interference uh, graphite here and then it has a USB 2 the way to recognize this uh, brand um, from the Chinese cheap ones is that it doesn't have this and also it has a uh, separate branching out from here a separate 3.5 millimeter jack for the uh, voice anyhow I'm going to use this for the rear view camera of course this is just an experiment is a little bit big for the to connecting to your back of uh, your bicycle and I, I have to mention that you can uh, attach this also to a tripod as well anyhow uh, the way to connect this to your uh, old mobile phones is via these uh, OTG connectors this is the Samsung OTG connector and this is the generic OTG connectors that you use in order to connect any USB devices to your mobile phone so when you do this you can have a rear view camera for your bicycle without any obstruction and you can at any moment you can record your video and um, take a uh, image take a shot of the uh, reverse view of your bicycle apart from that you have a view unobstructed view of your bicycle rear of your bicycle I'm going to connect this to your, my mobile phone via these OTG cables and then we are going to see the quality of the image and in order to do that some of the mobile phones you can just do that uh, uh, like a plug and play but there are apps on the Google Play Store that you can purchase the one that I have is free is OTG view that you can uh, turn the view uh, rotate the view if your camera is needs needing 180 or 90 degrees rotation and you can take a picture and take a video and it has a setting and rotation and uh, connection anyhow I show you the uh, app and then we connect this and see how the quality is first I show you the app this is the app OTG view and when you open it it's just asking you to connect this is the connection when you connect it it's prompting you to let me just put this here and then connect it and show you how it uh, performs when you connect it it's going to ask you do you want this to connect you say ok and then this is the connection you connect and let me just put this here and then this here and then focus it for you yes I think it's, it's done and as you see it can you can read it quite easily and the quality is not bad as I'm looking here then this is my hand and this is somehow the wide view of this my hand is 
let me just put this here and then my hand is in the screen right now you see and the quality is not bad is very good actually and you can use this for your rear view camera on your bicycle without any obstruction and the cable of this is long enough but there are loads of extensions that you can find that is really good anyhow this was a video about this uh, webcam and how to uh, make a rear view camera for your bicycle I hope you enjoy my video and find my video useful and until my next video take care of yourself and each other and as always have a great time